Today I would like to talk about something I remembered. I was thinking about my video with the Georgia Guidestones and the opening ceremony being on March 22nd or 322 of 1980. I also showed the Mount St. Helens eruption with what many called the pre-digital tech face of God picture by Grant Haller in the eruption plume on May 18, 1980 and it being 58 days between the two events. To me the 58 is important not only for the span of time between the ceremony of the opening of the Georgia Guidestones to the face of God image, but it also being the age King James passed away. As you may or may not know, King James was the King of England, Scotland, and Ireland who commissioned the King James Version of the Holy Bible. The King James Version, KJV, also known as the King James Bible, KJB, sometimes as the English Version of 1611, or simply the Authorized Version, AV is an English translation of the Christian Bible for the Church of England. Commissioned by King James in 1604 and completed as well as published in 1611 under the sponsorship of James VI and I. Well today I was considering the bizarre revelation of José Joaquim de Ferrer and his passing away on May 18, 1818 his birthday being October 26 which in 2001 would become the day the Patriot Act was published after the September 11th Towers Falling Down event. As I reviewed the information involving José Joaquim de Ferrer, I recalled he was the one who coined the term Corona for his astronomical observations of solar eclipse and the ring of light surrounding the black hole space the moon and its shadow passing in front of the solar disk would exhibit. Now we will examine the etymology of the word Corona. History and etymology for Corona. Noun borrowed from Latin Corona, garland worn on the head as a mark of honor or emblem of majesty halo around a celestial body, top part of an entablature. What are the odds Jose Joaquim de Ferrer's birth and death being tied to such monumental events as the eruption of Mount St. Helens May 18, 1980 and the Patriot Act October 26, 2001 only made possible by September 11? And now the pandemic of the coronavirus declared March 11, 2020 by the World Health Organization, the same date as the 1918 Spanish flu pandemic. Again what are the odds? As I was contemplating the interesting connections with the May 18th St. Helens eruption the passing over date of the man who coined the term Corona in the 1800s and the onslaught of the pandemic declared in the year 2020 with the coronavirus, otherwise known as COVID-19. I recalled another very interesting event that had to do with May 18th and the so-called suicide by hanging of the singer Christopher John Cornell of the world-famous rock band Soundgarden. It has been reported and accepted by the mainstream media as well as the sheep that feed there that Chris Cornell wrote a song that was recorded in 1993 and released in 1994 called Black Hole Sun. As you can see by my screen share the song Black Hole Sun has a running time of 5 minutes and 18 seconds. As you are probably aware 518 can also be viewed as May 18th. Another interesting aspect of all this can be found in the video for Black Hole Sun at the time stamp 327. Chris sings Hang My Head. Check it out for yourself. As you can see by my screen share King James reported date for passing was March 27th or 327.